Hey guys! What's up? Alpha Lion Simba here, and welcome to another creature comparison. Among the many requests I've received from my good friend Simon J, one of them is the African Bush Elephant, or Loxodonta Africana, and the African Forest Elephant, or Loxodonta Cyclostis. All right, Simon, this one's for you, my friend. Pack up your trunk, because this is a comparison of elephantine proportions that you will never forget. Okay, let's start with the similarities. First up, both the bush elephant and the forest elephant belong to the genus Loxodonta, which refers to lozenge, given the fact that their teeth are shaped like lozenges. And in both species, Female elephants live in herds that are led by the oldest female, known as the matriarch, while male elephants live alone, leaving their natal herd upon reaching maturity. And both species have very large ears that are said to look like the map of Africa. And there are a few reasons why elephants that live in Africa have such huge ears. One reason is to fan themselves, like when an elephant gets too hot, it flaps its ears and the cool blood in the ears flows through the rest of the body. But another reason is for intimidation. When an elephant charges, it flaps its ears forward to make itself look bigger in the eyes of predators. And in both species, both the males and females have tusks made out of ivory, which they use to peel bark off of trees, dig for roots and water, and as weapons in fights. In fact, an elephant can be either right tusked or left tusked, kind of like how a human can be either right handed or left handed. You can tell which is the favored tusk because the favored tusk is more worn down. And, both forest elephants and bush elephants eat branches, bark, leaves, fruit, roots, and grasses. And they eat for up to 14 hours a day, consuming as much as 300 pounds of food each day. And each day they have to visit a stream, pool, or water hole or mud pool to bathe themselves in water and mud. It both protects their skin from sunburn and parasites and helps to cool off. And getting back on their herd lives, elephants form strong social bonds both in their own herds and in herds of distant relatives or even just friends. And it's true that elephants never forget. Whenever an elephant comes across an old friend or distant cousin, it comes with a variety of greetings such as locking tusks and stroking each other with their trunks. Okay, now that we've had a trunk full of similarities, let's talk about the differences. First up, bush elephants, being the largest land mammals in the world, are much bigger. They weigh about 2,270 to 6,350 kilograms, or 5,000 to 14,000 pounds, are about 2.8 to 3.4 meters, or 9.2 to 11.2 feet long, and are up to 4 meters, or 13 feet high, at the shoulder. By contrast, with forest elephants, Bulls reach a shoulder height of 2.4 to 3.0 meters, or 7.9 to 9.8 feet, while females reach about 1.8 to 2.4 meters, or 5.9 to 7.9 feet tall, and they can range of from 2 to 4 tons. So in other words, a forest elephant can weigh 8,800 pounds. In terms of range and habitat, the bush elephant is found in many parts of sub-Saharan Africa and is mostly found on the savanna, although some have been recorded living in the Namib Desert. On the other trunk, the forest elephant, true to its name, lives in western and central Africa, mostly the Congo, 
and lives in the rainforest. <coughs> Bush elephants also live in larger herds, like a typical size for a bush elephant herd usually consists from 20 to even 70 individuals. By contrast, forest elephants, like Asian elephants, live in much smaller herds, usually around three to six females or even less. Some even live solitary lives. Also, due to the density of their habitats, Forest elephants are much more difficult to study than bush elephants. Very little is known about their behavior. In fact, the most that we've learned about their social habits was sightings of these elephants in clearings in the Congo forest known as bys. Even though they're smaller in size, forest elephants actually tend to sport bigger tusks than bush elephants. Sadly, though, this means that they're more frequently targeted by poachers. The current population estimate stands at a shocking low of 40,000. Then again, it could be harder to get the exact figures since they're so hard to study. By contrast, the current population of bush elephants stands at about 700,000 individuals. Well, that was it my creature comparison on the African bush elephant and the African forest elephant. Thanks for watching. Hope you liked it. If you liked the video, give it a thumbs up. Leave requests in the comments below. Don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already. Now, let's return to the safari hat and see what the next creature comparison is going to be. Let's see. Ah, well, the next one's going to be another remake, and it's a very serpentine remake. Alpha Lion Simba, out.